December 4, 2019. That'd be Flanders. Mark Metz go, well, piece sort of a little bit yesterday, a little bit of a gap lower. Did recover to close well, but not quite back to the plus column. Losing more than a half percent on the day. So far, as I've been saying, they could use a correction, and now, so far, they appear to be correct. The future's a strong pre market, so maybe the correction is over already. NASDAQ actually looks pretty good in here. I like the little pullback gap lower yesterday. Did recover late in the day. Lost about a half percent on the day. It too, just kind of pulling back. So far, Rusty, bit of a bummer, even though we're only off a third of a percent after all was said and done. It did pull back into this prior range. As I often say, when you don't break out too far past the prior peaks, one or two big down days, as you can see, can put you back into the sideways soup. Some areas like insurance got whacked fairly hard in here. Other areas, such as gold, a little flight to safety, maybe there, breaking out a little bit in this sideways range. These are the gold stocks. By the way, overall, most areas look pretty good still, at least longer term. Even some of these areas like the semis that got whacked fairly hard yesterday. Still kind of hanging in there. Longer term breakout remains intact. So what do we do? Well, start looking to get long again. Any questions, as usual, daily.com. I'm Dave Landry. You start the market a little more in a minute.